What's up, guys? How you doing? Just start my day off. Well, not really just start my day off. My day started off around 5 o'clock today. I just um, could not sleep any more. Um, I don't know whether it's because I'm excited about my day and I have so many things on my plate or uh, whether I just realized that getting up at 5 o'clock, you get more done in your day than you will if you sleep in. So I have a lot to get done. So I'm getting up early. I have a lot on my plate. So five o'clock is what it is. But anyway, um, today's a particularly beautiful day, right? Put on, I can put on my glass to see you a little better. How you doing? Um, today's a beautiful day. Look at this. Yes, I get to wake up to that beautiful sunrise. Incredible sunrise. And um, <clears throat> I already start off my day. I did my uh, yoga. Got nice and loose, loosened up. Got some energy flowing through my body. I got my good Pellegrino mineral water that I'm drinking, staying hydrated. Took my vitamins, supplements, and everything, and... Uh, now I'm going to start writing by hand some copy, right? <clears throat> this is what I do. Everybody says my writing I look like a, I'm possessed. That's just, uh, when I get into the flow of writing, I just write, I just scribble. But I understand what I'm writing, so that all helps. After that, <clears throat> I'll dig into another chapter of my book. So uh, that's my top 100 mistakes, and I'm uh, I'm ripping through that book pretty good. Got a lot going on with that book. <clears throat> then I'm uh, then I'll be reading this book here, Forever Cash by Jack Bosch. I already wrote my little journal entries. Had a crazy dream last night. Um. So one of the things that I think that you guys should do is write down your dreams, right? You never know. Uh, and I'm not talking about to play the lottery or nothing and get you little dream numbers. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about sometimes uh, you write down your dreams and what you do is, same reason I write in my journal, is you clear your mind, you clear your head of things that have been bothering you throughout the week so that you can focus more on your job or whatever you have to do. So, um, me, I write down my dreams, I journal, I write down what's on my mind, and then that way, everything else that I'm doing has so much more focus. That is just one of the tips that I like to give you guys. Start writing down what's on your mind. Take it out of your mind, put it on paper. Now, in the beginning, it may not make sense, but over time, I promise you, as you write it down and you go back and you go over your notes and you go down, go over things that you wrote down, um, you'll start to see patterns. You start to see patterns and you'll learn from those patterns and you'll understand yourself a whole lot more. Your decision making process, um, it could be relationship process, it could be how you're dealing with family. It could be anything from uh, your physical ailments, uh, everything. Everything is recorded in your brain. And if you write it down and you put it on paper, you can actually look at it and then put together patterns to help you to understand yourself. Because at the end of it all, the most important thing is to understand yourself, how you best taking information, how you um, best deal in relationships, how you best deal with people, how you best deal with stressful situations, right? How you best deal with challenges. Once you know yourself in all those areas, you will start to have a good life. So um, that was on my mind this morning. I wanted to give that information to you guys. This is my millionaire journey. 
it is early. It's single digit days. I think I'm doing this like five days. I'm not going to tell you guys every day what day it is because I really don't know. All I know is that just like when I was on a job, you know, if you had five years to go, you didn't count every day toward the five years. You know, if you got 25 years to go, you don't start counting day one that you got 24 years, 364 days. You realize what you have to do. You put your head down and you get into what you got to do. So my journey to becoming a millionaire, I'm going to put my head down and get some work done. So whatever it takes, whatever my mentors tell me I need to do, I'm going to put my head down. I'm going to get it done. And uh, as you guys follow the journey, what you will understand is it's about your commitment to what you're doing. And it's about staying consistent every day. Every day I may not seem like I make leaps and bounds. And you may not either feel like you make leaps and bounds toward your goal. But stop thinking that everything has to be instantaneous. You know, many times I get setbacks. And because I'm consistent, I just keep moving forward. You know?